Welcome back to Let's Supreme Ghost Thief. Moving on. <laughs> hey guys, name is Finn. Playing some the opposite of what I said. Okay, let's make a short little video here. Because I spent all my resources running around in Fenland. By which I mean Finland, by which I mean fence land, I believe is what I'm trying to say. And boy, oh boy, even the sunlight on the door is not gonna unspend me tonight. Oh, hey, it's a bar with some coins. That's my favorite kind of bar, especially one with a banner. Oh, you can't even slice it. Suspicious is also my favorite kind of bar. No coins under there, though. My coin quota has disappeared itself for the day. Oh, fan. Fan is now on. I'm a fan fan. Lyrics are no flim flam. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to steal some lyrics there. It's just something that was in my head. So this is the second level of the bar. It's got a fake door. It's the, the whoa, the greatest kind of bar you could possibly imagine. There's no half stepping, no half measures with me. Something's either the greatest or the worst or... Nice view. <laughs> or, or something or other. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, once again, the wind chime. Okay, let's let's just let's try to find the wind chime again, actually, shall we? Seems like a good idea. Is it this light? Anyways, yeah, that's right, that's right, I was... Oh, 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 oh. Well then. God damn freaking thing. Oh my god. Okay, well, let's instead then go as far away as we can from it, since the blasted thing won't unblast itself. Now, that guy's still around. And it's a good thing, too, because he can't be taken out. He knows how to pull the trigger. So, the police station, I could go in the front door now, but I'm not going to. Alright? Because instead, I'm going to do the thing I think maybe I'm intended to do, which is, like, sneak in the back or the oh. top. Oh, whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa! The Mac Daddy makes you jump! That was a Del the Funky Homo Sapien lyric and nothing else. Oh, don't have a map still. Weird. Well, at least I can unlock this unassuming door, which very well may have also had a guard guarding it, but this time I just don't know, so I'm going to assume the worst. Stables. Burrick stables. Oh well, hello there, Burrick. You're an actual Burrick, not friendly. You know, Burricks, they crap upstairs, I guess. I don't know. It's sort of nonsensical. It, like, sort of flies up around in a kind of hook shape and goes up onto the toilet upstairs. I guess, uh... I guess Burricks can't jump. Neither can I. And, uh... So I just sort of... pick the lock to get into here just for some... gold upstairs. That's pretty great. Wonder if one of these is defecated out a key. I guess not. Well, as fun as that sounds to sort of stick around the Burks for some reason, I'm probably not really gonna do it because, yeah. So, the cop station might have like a back entrance or something or a top. I know I've been on the top of it at one point, but uh, I prefer being on the bottom. Oh, <laughs> that was a joke. <laughs> I'm groaning at my own jokes. That's how you know I've become professional. Okay. I said, okay. Well, I said it in a slightly more betterly fashion. Wow. Betterly Hills Cop 3 was the first one I saw when I was a kid, and I thought it was pretty great. Apparently, it sucks. Okay. Alright. So, I just have to guess at what these are. Actually, wait a minute. A blacksmith shop. Have I found anything that looks like a blacksmith shop? I found a Burricksmith shop. But uh, the Burks were kind of brownish, not black. And since I'm a racist bastard, I will not handle brown Burks, only black ones. So it's kind of a strange kind of racism you don't find in America, but hey, you don't find me in America either. I'm on the polar north in the one island in the entire country that is not polar. <laughs> Pretty sweet deal. Alrighty, so loot is what? 2,000 in his option. But I'm still gonna try for it, because why not? This is kind of a super hardcore, just go and get stuff from the side paths kind of mission. Whoa. Okay. I'm gonna try. I mean, I know, once again, this is like a nonsensical idea, but breaking into the police station! Y'all know me. It's amazing that guy doesn't see these dudes. <laughs> Incredible. So, 
There's the front doors. Now, I was on top at some point. Now, I forgot if I'd explored everywhere that there is to explore on top. So I'll try again. Wait, wasn't I up there? Maybe not. Oh, right, okay. So, so, yeah. So now I'm here. Now, if I wished, I could... No. That's called a death wish. If you wish that, they laugh at you, then take you to see a psychologist. Iatrist. Some sort of tricksy, tricksy, tricksy trist, I'm sure. Okay. So I'm not supposed to get up there. So there's no... I'm not supposed to be up here then either. I wonder. I seriously wonder, because there's someone normally guarding that place. She was all like, yo! Also, how the hell did I get off of here? Did I? Oh, I did. Well, okay then, so I guess I must have gone over there. On top of the floaty light. Oh. That's... That's interesting. This, this mission is so cool! Can I get down the chimney? Without dying, I mean? Probably not. Uh, that should be my catchphrase right up there, my channel header. Fen Phoenix. Proxobably. Registered trademark, so you can't use it because I believe in that. Definitely. The internet definitely hasn't made all of that shit obsolete. Okay, so there is a back door. Uh, but, uh, hmm. How normally would one get down here without getting hurt to death? Eh? Because I don't think I can. Oh, I can. And there's some Z fighting. Ah! Oh, amazing. Okay. That seemed a little bit like luck if you ask me, but sure. Let's not ask too many questions, so... Oh. Right, I, I won't play badly if I can help it. I mean, I know that you might think it's a bit late for that, but... But hey. I'll even leave you be at your desk, because you seem to be a mad person. And I don't want to wake up you and have you be mad and stomp around my house cutting my internet off because I went to bed past 11.30. Giving me a lifelong fear of people walking heavily. Oh. Never mind. Out you go. Because nobody gets in the way of my banner slashing. <laughs> Sorry. Or am I? Okay. This is not as exciting as I thought it would be. Be honest. Just these dudes are watching the prisoners, taunting them, oh, well. you know, as you do. Good, good. Oh. You could even taunt them in your sleep, I, I, I bet you. So you shall. You gotta prove my random anecdotes that I say by, uh, you know, suffering the pleasures of tarot. So it's the jail key. So is it the cell's key or just the jail key, you know? Different thing. So I could let this person out if I wished. She doesn't seem to care, however. She's content. So I guess I'll just, uh, you know, who am I to interrupt her contentness? I'll just leave her in there. I don't know if there's gold on the floor here or something. Secret passage, maybe? I don't know. Seems pretty sparse here. I thought this police station was going to be epic. But it's not. It's not. And here I would have knocked out Mrs. Garderson. Why are there sandbags? Never noticed those. That's that's silly. Or or Burke dung bags. Wh oh, because it's a flood. Oh, of course. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Oh, so that guy's still guarding that place over there. However, I could get around him. And this is the kind of thing I'm talking about when I'm talking about ruining gameplay. Is, uh, you know, there's all these clever situations where you gotta go around and evade detection, and now that I've slaughtered everyone in the whole frickin' place, it's gonna be kinda difficult to fulfill that dream. But, anyways, yeah. Alright. So there's this fence over here, and I reckon. Oh, man. I reckon if I can manage, and I don't know if I can, but. Maybe it's just for show, huh? Could be. But if I could get over there, that would be the way that you're supposed. Yeah, see, you feel awesome, and you evade that guy without having to sneak up and blackjack him. Although I'll sneak up and blackjack this guy. Well, I'll sneak up anyway. Good day to you, sir. You have been snicked up on. Hope you are satisfied with this sneaky service that I have provided to you. Because I'm really Karis. That's why Garrett and Karis sound alliterative because they're the same person. 
I mean, person. Not really man, they're both robots. No. Oh, oh, now I'm back here. Let me try this again. Might have got lucky that one time. I don't know. These lights, kind of an irritant. Uh, eh, no, no, I guess. Uh, no, not lucky. Call me bad luck boot wearing Johnson. So somebody's slow walking, searching. Why? Probably because I dropped that blue vase, obviously. But uh, actually, there's doors right there. So actually, you are supposed to sneak up on him, I guess. Weird. Weird? That's not the waterworks, is it? Oh, I saw something. Ooh. What? <laughs> of course. Of course you just waltz right in. No, no, you, no, no problem. Well, okay, that ends up making a little more sense, I suppose. Uh, but let's just ignore that uh, bit of floppy up by yours truly and go in here once again oh man i saw a guy with a sweet car at the grocery store it was a red 350z or maybe 370 it was a z car anyways a new new one it was so clean and filled with rims i could not even believe my ears okay well i guess i guess we're on friendly terms now so no problem but there will be a problem if I can't find a dark spot such as this to brood in. I'm broody. Please place your eggs underneath me and they will hatch into young Ling beer. Everyone, everyone will be a black and white thinker. Okay. Think? I don't know where he is actually. Is he coming this way or what? I don't think so. Wow. See, this is how you play. You dodge around dudes, and then you, that you 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 dodge around dudes, and you feel proud of yourself. It's great. For some reason, the baby cradles always creep me out. I mean, there's no baby there, and also they kind of remind me of uh, the uh, the ones that are sometimes used in horror missions where there's like nothing or there's a dead skeleton in them or they remind me of the ones in the thief to ex brothel attic <laughs> i mean seriously it would be annoying enough if people would use protection but god imagine the life if they didn't that that's a pretty terrible life somebody should make a story about that i'm sure anyway dodge time is over have you seen the interiors? They're like cheap plastic. Or so I hear from one guy who has an obvious reason for bias. Let's see here. Alfred's letter. Charlie, last night I was visiting a friend at the hotel. During our conversation, I heard some loud yelling and then heard a loud thump. It seemed to come from room number four, which is my room. The desk clerk said that two members from the opera house were there and left in a hurry. The city watch are looking for them and will take them down no questions asked. There is something rather odd about all of this. I have the only key to my room and I was with her in the lobby at that time. Who's her? I've always had strange premonitions. I hope this doesn't mean you know what. Oh, with his friend. In the hotel, okay. So some, some guys. Okay, this was a letter sent. I gotta remember that that's a thing you can do, you know? You can be a guy sending a letter to another guy, so I gotta remember there's a hotel around here somewhere. Did I just go over here? Yep. It's the creepy crib room. Someone should also make a story where people drive crazy monstrous cars across a desert. I think it would be a feminist extravaganza. We've got both kinds of women. The kind that don't like cars and don't like their entire life and just want peace, and the kind that don't like cars but drive them anyway in order to achieve their goal, obviously. It's very progressive to, like, say that women should not like cars or we're gonna beat the shit out of you. It's so much better than saying that they should like knitting or we're gonna beat the shit out of you. Which has nothing to do with this mission! Awesome! Alrighty. That's kind of cheating, actually. I, I feel really bad about that. I feel so bad, in fact, I think I'm gonna leave it here, so see you guys next time. Maybe one day you'll grow as strong as this oak, and bye for now.